بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب زدني علما so the next thing we'll try to understand the different types of acls like again the we are talking about ip acls here as i said there will be separate acls like vlan acls also within the vlan as well so here we are talking about ip acls in this ip acls mainly there are two categories we have something called numbered acls or named acls so the difference is so these are the rules so if you see the rules these are the rules we define so it can be 2 it can be 3 it can be 10 20 any number of rules so all these rules can be identified with some number so i can give some number for identification like i'm saying uh, 120 is the number and if you are identifying with a the number then we call it as numbered acl and if the same rules if i'm writing on my router on my device with a name i'm identifying with a name then we call it as a named acl so the name itself says you know numbered acl number name acl means numbered acl means the rules are identified with a number whereas in the named acls the rules can be identified with name so we can use any one of this so basically i prefer the named acl uh, syntax because we can give some meaningful name like permit uh, some you know some server to like that we can give some meaningful name that will give a more uh, better understanding while you are verifying the configurations but again in the examples in the initial configurations i'll be using the numbered acl but later on we'll be also be seeing the named acl syntax how it's going to be now this is like the identification so identification of the acls can be done either based on the number or the name if you're using name then it is a named acl if you're using a number it is a numbered acl but again the main classification is standard or extended so both numbered or named acls are actually classified into standard or extended acls now the difference is standard acls are more like a basic acls uh extended acls are more like advanced acls so we can say like that if you want to implement some basic rules we use a standard acl if you want to implement some advanced rules then we use extended acl but again there are a couple of differences we'll see again these are the differences you can see here but i have a presentation in the next slide here